Alright guys, I'm at Buffalo Exchange. I'm low-key trying to film like the manager's right behind me. I'm gonna quickly show you guys what I found because I found some nice items. So we have this Champion Huge Logo Size XL. Seems like it's brand new. Got the little Champion logo right there. Then we found this brand new with tags Versace jeans. Next, I found this Burberry Golf zip-up fleece, the plaid on the inside. Burberry spell out on the side. On this vintage Perry Ellis track suit, the matching jacket with the pants, and it has Perry Ellis America all down the ribbing. Super fire. So I just found this Hilfiger Athletics, little athletic jersey. Not sure if I'm gonna cop it though. It's nothing really too special. It just has a little H on the back. We'll put it in the cart just in case. Vintage Polo Ralph Lauren, Polo Spell Out, nothing special. Now this is more like it. We got the Vintage Tommy Jeans, Tommy Jeans 85, definitely a cop. In the bag section we do have this Marlboro Vintage little cooler it almost looks like because the inside is insulated. They're asking 12 bucks though, so I think I'm going to pass on this just because I have so much Marlboro stuff. Like it's actually funny, I'm actually using my Marlboro backpack at the moment. But we're gonna leave that for somebody else, even though the patch would be nice to even take, but yeah, we'll leave it. And you guys already can tell by the colorway, we have this vintage Polo Ralph Lauren, almost like a duffel bag. Again, we have so many of these, so we are gonna leave this here. How much are they asking? Seven bucks, not bad. So after a long day, I finally made it back home. Now, three days ago, I did go to Goodwill and I honestly forgot my camera. You know, sometimes I do walk into thrift stores not even planning on making a trip to the thrift. And I'm not the type of guy that likes to record me finding stuff and then just throw it into trips to the thrifts. Go to thrift stores, I go that exact day and find the finds that I find. You know, I'm not gonna, stuff that I found three weeks ago, I'm not gonna just throw in. But I figured this is too nice of a find to just leave out. So, I did find a Fear of God or a Fog Fear of God. This is collection one. This is a regular black shirt. It is a size medium, but could fit about a large. I think I'm actually gonna keep this for personal. I have already the gray one and I have the beige one. I don't have collection one though. I actually got it with the essentials. So the fact that there was a collection one for $2 is a steal. And I'll throw the clip of me actually finding it at Goodwill so you don't think I just randomly picked up this shirt. So, so put the fear of God out of the way. We'll jump into today's finds that we actually found today. We'll start it off with the most recent. We have this size medium vintage Tommy jeans. This is a red shirt. It says Tommy jeans with number 85. And then you have the little Tommy flag going underneath. This is a little bit faded, so I'll do this for about $20 shipped. Next, we have brand new with tags. This is Versace jeans. Like I said, brand new with tags. It's about a large to XL. At the bottom, it, you see it says Versace jeans. Then it has like the gold foil with the Vs. Really nice shirt. The actual sizing says it's a 2XL, but since it's Versace, the sizing is a little small, so I'd say about a large to XL. Versace jeans. This will be about $45 to $50 shipped. Uh, retail is about $100 plus on these. Next, which I personally want to keep, but I think I'm gonna actually sell it because it's an ex extra large. We have the Vintage Like Champion with a huge patch as well as the little arm patch right there. This is a size XL and like the nude. Actually, I'm wearing like the same thing. I am wearing the same shirt as yesterday. I kind of left off yesterday when saying I was going to Buffalo Exchange, starting it back today. So we have the Champion Big Flag Shirt, size XL. This will be about $25 shipped. If you guys have been watching me for a while, you guys already know I'm the Burberry King. Literally, I find Burberry almost every other week. I go thrifting. When I used to hit up Miami, we used to find Burberry trench coats, like literally like it was a plain white tee. And today, we did find some Burberry. This is size large, Burberry Golf. And this is like a fleece pullover. On the left arm, we do have Burberry spell out in yellow, if that will focus right there. 
Then the collar is the Nova check. You can either wear it up or you can have it down to flex. This is about a light blue colorway. And then on the back, which I've never seen before, we have a zip pocket on the back, which you could probably put maybe some money, your wallet, your keys, but it is on the back. It's not on the side. So don't think that this has pockets. It's just one big pocket. It does have a navy blue going pinstripe going down the sides. Again, size large, maybe could fit medium, but this thing is so fire. Like that Burberry print, Woo! come on now. And for the last item of today, today wasn't too big of a day. We did hit up three thrift stores. I didn't film in any of them just because I literally didn't find anything. I'm not the type of person that just likes to walk into a thrift store like, oh, let's see what we can find. If I don't find anything, then I'm not gonna pull out the camera. It's just a waste of footage. I know it would be beneficial to have this video reach 10 minutes for AdSense, but it's not gonna happen. Again, something else that I wish is in my size is a size XL Vintage Perry Ellis America tracksuit. So we have the windbreaker. You can see we have Perry Ellis ribbing on the arms going throughout. And we have the matching track pants with the Perry Ellis pinstriping going down. This track suit will be $60 shipped for both for the pants and the jacket. Again, size XL. If you watched yesterday's vlog, you know that obviously I found a lot of stuff that wasn't listed in my website or stuff that I thought was sold that didn't end up selling. So I feel like for the next few vlogs, I'm gonna have a little pile, like I just went into my inventory room and grabbed this pile of t-shirts. We'll show you guys each vlog, like a little stack of clothes, just to show you guys what I do have in the inventory. You know, a lot of people don't go on the website and look, and then once I show it on film, it, it sells out literally within a day. But literally, it's been sitting for a couple weeks. So let's just run through it real fast. We have a size 2XL Black History Month shirt. We have a size medium large Obama chain shirt. We have a size XL 1997 Marlins World Series. Size XL vintage cross colors. Size XL, we have vintage MLK, double sided, I have a dream. Size medium, we have double-sided Black History Month. And all these shirts are about $15 to $20 shipped. We have a size small, Black History Month, 365 again. Size large, we have another Obama shirt, slash Black History, 365 on the back. Size large, Florida Marlins, vintage with Taz. Size 2XL, positive women. And then last but not least, size large Obama, new beginnings. So everything I just showed you will be for sale, link down below. Make sure you guys go check it out. Again, if you guys want a bundle price, if you want to buy you know, five or six items at a time, just send me a DM or an email at ditr954 at gmail.com or the Instagram at ditr954. Make sure you guys go check the link down below. I hope you guys enjoyed today's little vlog. I'm sorry that it wasn't much. Again, an apartment tour should be coming in the next day or two, but we're knocking out this daily vlog. You know, we gotta get back on this grind. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for another EMC vlog. And don't forget guys, let's get it. I've been fucking hoes and popping pillies, man. I feel just like a rock star. Brothers got that gas and they always be smoking like a rock star before this video ends, I'm gonna give you a kind of a little sneak peek of my new apartment. I'm not gonna give you a full apartment tour because honestly, you guys will see it is so messy, but let's jump into it. Then I found a stack of bear shirts, which I was totally surprised. I honestly thought that we sold out of these, but I have a size large. These are all brand new with tag size large. We have the basketball bear. All these will be 45, so $40. Then we have the golf, and by the way, $40 is retail, so basically I'm just trying to get rid of it. We have the golf bear, XL, $40.